What's up? What's up? <laughs> hey man, beautiful Saturday today. We outside, just did some yard work, just throwing a football. Need to hit y'all with a few updates because I ain't made a video in a, in a little while. It's been winter, it's been chilling. But uh, I think we almost at uh, a thousand subs. Uh, so I just checked right before I turned this camera on and I was at uh, 961. So 39 more subscribers and we will be at 1,000. So I appreciate everybody that's been, you know, clicking, you know, dropping comments and all that good stuff. So, um, so I'm just trying to figure out how to make uh, short videos. All my videos be 12, 15 minutes. So I'm gonna try to figure out how to start doing some short videos. I just want to give an update to, especially all the new folks who's joined and haven't really posted anything since. But um, oh, that motorcycle passed by. Yo, while that motorcycle was passing by, I hate the new intro. YouTube got all this copyright stuff going on now, so I had to change the song. So if y'all wondering, you know, why he had a hard beat, you know, in the old videos, and now it's changed to that little copyright free stuff, it's because YouTube not playing games about playing any piece of music from somebody in your video. That's why the intro has changed. The motorcycle should be gone now, so let me get you back. Just want to let y'all know that. All right, he's gone. All right, so on um, with the truck. So if y'all don't follow me on social media, uh, definitely Instagram. Um, riding with Mike, same as the YouTube. Um, a lot of y'all probably don't know uh, what I did to it um, just before Florida Classic. So of course, you know, I um, showed y'all videos of the music I had in the doors. But um, if you don't follow me, then y'all probably have missed uh, what I've done. So hold on, let me flip the camera around for you. So for those of y'all that don't know, that's how we coming in the truck. So that is eight Crescendo UN10s. Um, then we got um, four... We call these throats, but four audio pipe compression drivers. Um, basically, it's ran off of another 8K. Um, the audio pipes are on a Tampiano 800.2. So, yeah, like I say, I built this, you know, just before Florida Classic, you know, just to head down there, and um, it's loud, <laughs> real, real loud. So. Um, it's actually, I never even finished the thing, so um, I got a screen that actually is going to go over it and look just like the door, but I just never put it on. I actually, it looks more scary when it looks like this. Like, yes, uh, you see this? <laughs> it's crazy, but anyway, yeah, I got a screen um, and lights to go in it, so it'll be just like the doors. Uh, but yeah, like I said, I did that, and um, you know, I've been built a box on my homeboy in his truck, and so, you know, I had speakers. Bought some compression drivers, built the box, threw it in. So, like I say, oh, if you're standing right here when I got this thing on full tilt, it's probably gonna do some some hearing damage. Like it's, it's you know, I'm really bragging on my stuff a lot, but this truck right here ain't no joke. If you come around this one, you really got something. So, um, I think that's really it for the truck. Uh, I did the bait. I'm going 26 by 14s on basically the same wheel. This is my favorite wheel, basically. So I did debate that, but I don't think I'm going to do it. It's just a necessary money. So I'm still happy on the 24s. Again, it's 24 by 14. And um, I don't really want to cut much more than what I already did. Um, you know, a lot of y'all been asking me about the lights. Um, Man, my lights is, I mean, I ain't had no problems out of them. Uh, still look good. I mean, it's they're still crystal clear, still shines bright. And a lot of people ask me, you know, what I think. Do I think you should do it? I absolutely think that you should do it, just because it makes the truck look so much newer. But anyway, we got enough, you know, on the lights and, and all that good stuff. But um, other than that, I'm probably gonna change out. See in there, um, I'm gonna change out the head unit. Look at my son. I told him not to step in the my shoes. I mean, in my seats with his muddy shoes. Anyway, we probably gonna get the head unit changed out on there. So I will show y'all the head unit I'm gonna go with, show y'all the install process. That's it for the truck. 
Um, I will be at Dub Show Charlotte this year. Uh, probably in the truck and the car. Um, I'm guessing. But uh, yeah, I mean, it, other than that, she's ready. Riding good still. No, no problems at all out the truck. So then that brings me to the Charger. You know, what's going on with the Charger? Not much. Um, I did drive it not long ago. Uh, went to a little dinner in it. And uh, she's good. But I got a huge update for y'all on the Charger. And the news on this is it is going back stock. So um, I'm going to do a small video. I don't know if it's going to be one or two parts. But we're returning the Charger to stock. Don't worry. Um, it's for a great reason. Um, so yeah, just stay tuned for that. I said that video will probably be up in the next, you know, two, three weeks. Um, I'm take my time with it because uh, I do got some other things going on. But we're definitely getting this at um, least closer to stock. So, see how close we can get it. And, uh, yeah, so stay tuned for that. So, all y'all new subscribers, all my old subscribers, I still appreciate y'all. Um, stay tuned. We're going to keep this thing going. Show y'all some upgrades. Um, I'm guessing for a 1,000 subs. Um I don't know, once I reach that thousand mark, maybe we'll pull the charge out, uh, do a couple donuts or something. I mean, I don't know, I can do nothing crazy, I can turn my stuff up, but, uh, no, we'll, we'll do a couple donuts, uh, you know, celebrate 1,000 subs. Again, appreciate y'all. Make sure to like, uh, subscribe, hit that bell for me. I will holler at y'all later.